everybody this is Tika with Tika Loves Fashion um, I'm gonna be talking about all things fashion from shoes to clothes jewelry um, anything pretty much that goes along with fashion since fashion is art what well, I call it art anyway uh, but I just think that everything is gonna be incorporated into my channel and I do believe that you're gonna love it YouTubers, this is Tika with Tika Loves Fashion. On my channel, I'm going to be talking about everything from cool handbags to fire sneakers, but not in that order. I'm also going to be talking about clothing hauls and just what I think about the fashion industry in general. So tune in. So today, I'm going to be talking about two particular sneakers um, for in no particular order um, I have some Nike SB's with me today and I picked these because these um, currently are my two favorites I'm going to talk about the second one later but these right here these the Street Hawkers um, I really really uh, like these I took a L on the sneakers app like most of us do and my cousin was um, fortunate enough to say hey I'm gonna go ahead on uh, StockX and get you the Street Hawkers um, so I believe that he got them for a good price but um, I, I just wanted them I mean I love the whole different shoe vibe I know many people don't but with me just loving fashion, loving art, I believe that this was the perfect, perfect shoe. Um, the, j just the whole concept behind it, you know, from the paper being a, a menu, from the, the, the shoe incorporating different foods and spices. Um, it just, I, I just knew that I had to have it, especially with the different colors. Um, even even the point where they have the the ostrich um, looking thing, but they but they said it represents the goose from um, where in China they're you know cooking the goose, and right here represents uh, the chili oil and the fire. Just the whole concept behind um, the shoe with Nike SB, it's perfect. It, they always create a story. I love a good story, and I just really really enjoy. Um, you know getting uh, th these shoes but it's not that easy as, as we all know um, on to the the second shoe I know it's uh, more a more lighter base I know some people were saying you know you know this one was a little different but it's still perfect to me that it rep still represents the food It's still going with the theme It's still um, going along with the pita bread it's going along with the the soups I just really I mean like the, there is no other pair like this and what what it represents and how Nike SB always has something to talk about you know and it creates a, a long journey for you to follow and to study and I when when I wear these you know you could wear these with different things with different laces um, you see they have the green right here, they have the tan, I mean, I, I just really think that you could wear it with denim, you could wear it with dresses, you could wear it with um, pants, it's just, even though they, they are two different, totally different shoes, you could really um, do anything you want with them, and it would be your own style. So, um, the Street Hawkers, definitely in my book, um, were a 10 out of 10 for me. I really, really just think that the the story behind it and the whole concept of both of these shoes um, was is a, is a ten out of ten. I mean, I feel like I could wear it in all seasons. Um, I can, you know, um, incorporate it with different socks, jogging pants, you know, whatever I feel like doing at the time. So. These right here, I would definitely give a 10 out of 10 for, for, for the Street Hawkers. And I do, um, right now, I think they're at a good price on StockX. 
But like I said, um, I got these about a month ago. Have not worn them yet. I cannot wait to wear them. Um, but, you know, I've always enjoyed um, having a pair of Nike SB. I don't have many, um, but I do hope to get some more in the future. So now we're getting ready to talk about the second shoe, pair of shoes, which are, as of right now, um, my favorite. And you guys probably know what that is. I, I told you guys that I, um, you know, had another pair of SBs. And I'm sure that you guys already knew what pair I was talking about. But um, these are the, the what the paw or what the P-Rod. Uh, first of all, I like pretty much any type of what the vibe going on you know i do have what the lebrons um have what the kobe's is for some reason those have always always caught my eye um like the the whole different pair of shoe vibe has just always been um something that i like it's catchy um you know it causes people to look down like you know what in the world do you have on but hey it's it's a fashion statement um i i love any type of what the vibe but these i um was doing so many raffles for these um and luckily um someone i know was able to win uh, me a pair at a skate shop and i was so so happy because i lost pretty much on any and every platform and every raffle um which of course i know that you guys have also had that happen too but the reason why I like these shoes is just the whole detail um, of each of these shoes I mean they have so much detail the to incorporate ten shoes within these two pair and also to just place them. It seems like it, it, everything was placed perfectly um, from the, the, the toe boxes to, you know, the outer soles. It's just everything to me is with these two pair are, are perfect. Um, even with the different laces that it comes with. Um, I'm sure I will be swapping out um, some laces when I finally start rocking these, but um, the bright color is catching my eye. But I just I just believe that with uh, Paul Rodriguez, you know, first of all, shout out to you um, on your all of your accomplishments. Just these are, mm, I, I don't know, they, these are just fire, guys. Um, I. I have not, uh, as you can see, have not worn these yet, just the, because I have, I just want to sit back and admire them first, um, because these, the, the, the elephant print, the fact that, um, you know, P-Rod always had, you know, a, a Jordan type of theme going on, you know, being a, a sneaker collector himself, I just believe that. It, it, it that's what really really made the the shoes the fact that you can see every aspect of what he has done and I, I couldn't think of anything of anything better to to do with you know with all of his accomplishments to just put them on two shoes I mean I can't I, I can't I can't believe it it's like I'm still in awe that I had I finally you know got the pair after I thought that I had took all the L's I could take and um, I did have someone to help me out and it ended up working out in my favor um, but I did really really go hard and try to get get the shoe so obviously you know I would rate these a 10 out of 10 um, just because just the whole concept behind it um, the heritage that's incorporated into the shoes and uh, it's just unbelievable. Um, I, you know, someone asked me, you know, what I think about reselling them. And no, these are going to be a personal pair for me. These are definitely going to um, be worn. Um, I do try to wear all my shoes, but 
uh, just the whole concept of what has happened with these shoes are it is amazing. Um, I don't actually know when I'm going to wear the shoes. Um, it, hopefully, you know, it will be soon. Um, but, you know, the my fashion will be seen on this channel. But also, you know, you can follow me on um, Tika Loves Fashion. And my, you know, fashion sense is on there. Um, I, you know, I do post different things, different outfits, um, different shoes. They're not always sneakers. But... You know, if you guys could get you get your hands on a pair of these, um, it would just you would see in person that these shoes are, are excellent. And I do like the quality. Um, I like the inside quilt material. Um, I've I've never had an issue with um, the the Nike SBs as far as comfort. I have thought uh, you know always thought that all of them were comfortable. For me, you know, I do tend to have um, skinny, narrow feet, so, you know, I don't have an issue with the, the padding or anything. Um, so true to size for me, but, oh my gosh, like, I just am thankful <laughs> that, that I did finally get these. Um, so, so far, these are my favorite pair of SBs for um, 2021. So, so far, I'm quite sure as time goes on, you know, um, I may have to put another pair against these, but as of right now, um, nothing is comparing to these. So, you know, follow my journey um, on here on uh, YouTube, and you know, you get to see different fashions, and you get to see different sneakers that I have picked up. Um, I did score some more sneakers on, on the sneakers app the other day, which I'll be rating next week so you guys have to wait to next week to see that um but and i will show you what those are i heard that they were good quality so hopefully they are in person but everybody that would be it for me and i thank you stay tuned hey youtubers thanks for tuning in Please do not forget to hit that subscribe button and the like button and also follow me on IG, Tika Loves Fashion, to see some of my fashion tips and pretty much how I just dress things in general. Tune in.